Hello everyone, welcome to this channel. Last time we explained uh, one small project with a uh, um, 0.91 inch uh, screen and uh, uh, showing a timeline bar. And uh, now I found another more attractive uh, development board with a small screen. 1.3 inch and uh, uh, encoder integrated on this board and also there are two buttons uh, on this board and I also found another buzzer alarm so that we can have a full function uh, uh, pro model clock and uh, I also uh, coded this uh, selection menu so I will explain how this kind of uh, manual is uh, easily done by uh, uh, a simple item and uh, the driving board is uh, Arduino Nano. So let's go to the, maybe we check, uh, we try out uh, the function. Uh, the Even the button is working. So once I clicked this uh, knob, the counting down start and uh, there is even a uh, finishing uh, there is a finishing screen flash and also the butter alarm uh, let's go to the the code here so let me explain again the Arduino uh, uh, coding coding uh, rules so first of all there will be a library import and the defining this portion defines all the pin locations including the OLED uh, pin locations and all the buttons and the uh, and the, uh, the encoders and uh, the key uh, portion of this uh, project is this uh, menu item so the menu is already uh, key in here as a uh, uh, text and uh, later we will use the some manual defined functions to to print uh, to select the, the lines to be print uh, in the screen so uh, the selection part is actually uh, achieved by printing uh, three or four lines at one time so that uh, you thought uh, the, the screen is actually uh, uh, changing from the manual but inside uh, is, uh, uh, is done by this uh, very simple uh, item and uh, the item is uh, uh, selected by the indexing uh, system so this portion is the uh, main function of uh, Arduino, any Arduino program here the, in the pro, uh, setup uh, function you can uh, initialize all the, the pin numbers, uh, the pin state and in the looping uh, the whole uh, program is uh, running one uh, round by round of this portion so what we have done in this portion is that we uh, start with the uh, menu index and uh, with the reading uh, digital reading from our encoder we update uh, the update the index and uh, decide what to be to be to be printed in the in the menu so we have three uh, menu defined functions one of them is this uh, draw menu it will draw four lines so according to your selection um, that will update uh, the indexing number uh, of the menu and uh, here this function uh, called over here will draw the uh, the screen that you have selected it it will not only draw the line that you have selected it will also plot the uh, above and the below items so that uh, uh, 
uh, we thought the menu is uh, screening uh, rolling down and up and uh, this uh, line has no uh, other purpose it's just uh, drawing a rectangle around the selection and uh, this function uh, finish uh, the counting down and show a white screen with black num uh, text or the black screen with a white uh, text and also the the buzzle sound is also uh, uh, triggered by these uh, uh, simple lines so with this uh, uh, very simple code you can have uh, this kind of a selection and uh, it uh, performs like a menu and a sub menu function so that's all for this uh, uh, introduction and uh, I will share all the code and the uh, project procedure uh, in this uh, uh, website uh, I have a small uh, github uh, web to sh demonstrate all of my uh, interesting projects and uh, most of them now is under construction so uh, but the code will be uploaded and uh, the pin location uh, will be introduced uh, in details in the website so thank you for watching and uh, see you in the next video